Scott. But can you live oh. on the top with the left hand? That's <laughs> the real true. I almost true. did it. All right. Uh, you know what? Today, no matter which hand you had, it was definitely probably sweating a bit as we stepped on out of the door. Right now, as you take a look at DFW, lots of sunshine greeting you. Temperatures continuing to warm up. We're at 92 in Dallas, 93 in DFW, which is very close to average. When you factor in the dew point, it feels a little bit warmer. It feels like 97 right now at DFW to 96 in Fort Worth. So we have temperatures sitting at 91 in Flower Mountain. To 92 in Allen, 90 in Duncanville, to 90 in Weatherford. So a typical June day, summer, the uh, you know summer solstice starting tonight at 11:24. So the first full day of astronomical summer starting tomorrow. Meteorological summer started at the beginning of the month. Either way, it's been warm for us. We're still sitting at 91 in Waxahachie, 91 in Athens, to 89 in Sulphur Springs, and 91 in Mineral Wells. Tonight, if you're headed out to Globe Life Park, temperatures will be in the upper 80s by 7 o'clock on our way down to 83 degrees at 9. Then down to 79 degrees by midnight with a northeast wind at five miles per hour. Tomorrow, temperature starting in the mid 70s on our way back up to about 94. That feels like temperature actually possibly near 100, and that's going to be about it with a northeast wind at 10 to 15. The other big story that we are now tracking is we have Tropical Storm Cindy. You can see a lot of the rain already working its way onshore, Louisiana, parts of Mississippi, Alabama, and the Panhandle of Florida. Center of circulation is still out over the open water. It will. Pull its way off towards the north into the northwest. It's been stalling over the past couple of hours. Right now, winds are sustained at 45. The movement is stationary. It's 280 miles south of Morgan City, Louisiana, that center of circulation. But going through the next probably 24 hours, we'll pull its way towards the north and west, approach the Texas coastline and the southwest Louisiana coastline by tomorrow afternoon with winds near 50 miles per hour. So strengthening just a bit, the latest forecast models are showing, then possibly making landfall late tomorrow afternoon into the Early probably evening hours of Wednesday evening, right near possibly the uh, Louisiana Texas coastline near Beaumont, if it takes that perfect center track and then will pull its way off towards the north by probably Thursday afternoon, east sides of the state, still as a tropical storm, downgrading to a tropical depression by Friday afternoon near about one o'clock. So, what does that mean for us here in North Texas? Well, we have the potential of maybe some rains. There are tropical storm watches along the Texas coastline and the Louisiana coastline. A lot of rain is going to work its way on in. As we go through probably the next 36 hours through the east sides of the state, maybe dealing with two to three inches of rain, getting a little bit closer towards the southeast start parts of North Texas. But going into Thursday afternoon, you see that wraparound. We could see some showers, maybe some isolated storms in the forecast. Seven day shows rain chances 20 to then 30 percent winds coming up going into the weekend. Rain chances also sticking around. A cool down on the way to Sunday, only 85 degrees. Thank you, Scott.